Hi y'all, welcome to Southern Staples. Thanks for joining me today, and if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so, and I'd love for you to invite your friends and family as well. Thanks so much, and have a great day. Hi y'all, welcome back to Southern Staples today. Today we're going to talk more about our series of sterling. This is how to care for your sterling silver. These are just some basics about storage and use. Um, this is actually something that I highly suggest if you have sterling or if you plan on starting a collection to get a silver chest. Now they're available in all price ranges as you can see this one opens nicely. You can store your your knives up here in these slots and then you can serve your different size um, fork forks and spoon sizes. These are your um, dinner, salad, and then your spoons. And then this also has a drawer. And most of them do have a drawer at the bottom. As you can see, there's a serving piece. And then you can put your different assorted serving pieces down there that are a little odd sized. But just some basic care about your Starling. Actually, the more you use it, the less you have to polish it. So really, that makes for the easiest care of Starling. Just getting it out and using it. But if you are kind of growing a collection, um, there are some just basic tips. If you do use it, some people say you can use the dishwasher. I personally do not put Sterling in the dishwasher. That, you know, maybe you look up your Sterling manufacturer's guidelines. I prefer to hand wash it. I feel like it's an investment and an heirloom piece. And hand washing really does not take that much time. When you do hand wash, just make sure that you are sure to really wipe it dry and get all the spots off. And then also, never ever, if you do put it in the dishwasher, never wash it with stainless steel. That will absolutely ruin your sterling. And also avoid some egg, avoid acidic foods really staying on there like eggs, vinegar, mayonnaise, lemon. And don't ever let your sterling soak overnight. Some other basics, you probably will want a simple polishing cloth. This is one that I just happen to have. And you can just store this in your silver chest, fold it up up here over your silver, or you can fold it up and put it in your drawer below. And another thing to have on hand, you can use any brand. I picked up this right silver cream at my local grocery store. And... Um, it's really, really easy to use. It comes with a sponge, and you just dampen the sponge. And this is good because over time, you know, if you don't use your silver that frequently, you will need to polish it. So these are just some basic housekeeping tips on your sterling and also for storage. Here you go. This is the chest again. So thanks, and you all have a great day. If you're interested in specific sterling patterns, feel free to check out my other videos and also some China videos as well. Thanks so much. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. And if not, um, also share with your friends and family. Thanks so much, and y'all have a great day.